what's going on people welcome back karibu kenya uh, welcome back to kenya um, i just came back for my third time and i just got here it's approximately 10 o'clock in the morning and i'm about to check in into this new place i'm going to be staying in which i'll show you guys in a minute but first things first though um last time i was here it was ne it's nearly six months ago last year and uh, my sim cards i was using while i was here got deactivated so i'm gonna have to go back to reactivate my sim cards or get new sim cards but i'm gonna keep you guys posted i got uber driver here but these are the apartments i'm gonna be staying in they look they're really nice the name is up there called luxury service apartments of course i'll give you guys a tour like i always do when i'm checking in officially but um what i'm gonna do go so I'm a sim cars and then we're gonna go we're gonna bubble you're probably wondering which area i'm gonna be staying in it's the same area i stayed in last time you know i love westlands here in nairobi so same area but different apartments so yeah i'm back in kenya and yeah i'll continue the vid once i go to the sarit mall to sort out my sim cards okay so guys uh just made it to the mall i'm gonna make my way down to safaricom to sort out my sim cards to activate them again like i said because i left here six months ago and i was using the same sim cards i used on my two tours i came here so they deactivated them so now i have to go reactivate them again if they can activate them cool if they can't then i have to get new sim cards but also guys yeah if you're coming to hang out it helps to exchange some money and come with some cash yes they use mpesa here the system i always tell you guys about but obviously i couldn't use them pesa when i was coming because my sim cards weren't working so when i got here i had to use an to get an uber i couldn't because i had no internet on my phone so i had to use one of them cars taxis them personal ones yeah so i had to pay but look at that lines that's safaricom that's where i'm supposed to be going but yeah, it looks like it's very busy so i'll try the other one in the corner but yeah exchange some money and come with some cash and then obviously if you can't use your M-Pesa when you get here, cash can help a little bit. Then when you activate your SIM, you can. Let's see if they're working. I'll get back with you guys in a bit. Yeah, so looks like I'm gonna wait for a little while. The queue's a bit long, as you can see. Yeah, so make your way around the corner and then come inside here. So I'll keep you guys posted. I'll let you know what happens because uh, I got my SIM cards with me. I don't know if they're gonna re reactivate them again, or I'm gonna get new SIM cards. So I'll let you guys know. All right, boom, we're done here. It took a little while, but like I said earlier, when I was coming in, I said I was either gonna need to replace my SIM cards or reactivate my old SIM cards. So it turned out to be I couldn't reactivate the old SIM cards. I had to get new SIM cards, which took a, excuse me, <laughs> which took a while. Um, again, I had to, obviously, to produce my passport because I have to take a copy. Whoop. Yeah, so if you do um, come to Kenya and then you don't use your SIM cards for, I don't know, more than six months, because I was last year, last year in July. That was the last time I used my SIM cards. That way or this way? You wanna go this way? So six months ago, that's when the last time I used my SIM cards. So when I came, like, um, yeah, they were deactivated. So they had to reactivate them again and then top up the M-Pesa again. So keep that in mind. If you, if you have SIM cards and you don't use them for more than six months, you're gonna have to get new SIM cards. But anyway, we're done here. I'm about to exit first few hours here back in Kenya. So. The boy needs to go do some shopping. So I'm gonna go to uh, one of the quick marts around there, get some essentials, you know, toothpaste and all of that stuff. Cause I just got to my new apartment, which I'm gonna show you guys in a minute, once I get there. So, we're exiting through here. I'm gonna grab a car and go do some shopping. But yeah, man, beautiful day back here in Nairobi, as you can see. The guy that actually gave me a lift is here, but I don't know if I wanna use him again. It's a nice day, I might just walk. Yeah. Beautiful day back in Nairobi. Sarit Mo. Just saw it at the M-Pesa. And yeah, let's go hit the streets. 
do some shopping and I'll continue the vid once I'm done some shopping and I'm on my way home to show you guys my new apartment that I'm gonna be staying in all right catch you in a bit these are the streets of Kenya as you can see right here Westlands Nairobi where I was before you guys are familiar with this if you this area here you guys should be familiar with it if you've been watching my old series when I was here my first series and my second series this is my third series I'm gonna be staying here for a few days then I'm gonna go to a different city but yeah the question is why did I come back to Nairobi or overall why did I come back to Kenya that's the question so there's a few reasons one of the reasons is obviously because it's a beautiful country beautiful weather so more reasons but I'm gonna go that way do some shopping busy streets oh it's nearly lunchtime as well your boy's gonna get some ugali and some skuma wiki and all of that good stuff I'll continue the video in a minute once I get to the shopping mall all right we're back here I'm looking for some slides to buy to wear when I'm indoors so me being me when I was packing my stuff when I was leaving Kampala I forgot my slides back home so I need a pair of slides to wear when I'm in the yard so I'm gonna look around there and see what they've got and I'll show you if I find something but we're here on the strip uh, Westlands market and then after I'm gonna go over there one of my favorite restaurants I'm gonna get some food all right let me see what I've got hello do you guys have slides don't take me with that camera. nobody's filming you relax i'm filming myself no i don't I'm, i remember you from last time you said the same thing no i wasn't filming you anyway i'm looking for slides you don't sell slides no, we don't come. do you have slides all right let me ask this guy so that woman like she thinks people are gonna be filming her like nobody's filming her i remember her from last time hi my friend hello do you sell slides shoes okay so yeah she's paranoid even last time like i was here i think if you guys watched the other videos before like she's like don't film me but like, don't worry nobody's filming you i don't film you yeah she gets paranoid i don't know maybe i don't know she's hiding from something <laughs> i don't know but anyway let's enter this market see if we can find slides nobody's got them outside but looks like they've got kids shoes but I want slides for your boy if they'll fit me. Ah, they've got Crocs. They've got Crocs here. I don't know if they have my size. Hello. Hi. Right, do you do you have slides? You want to have Crocs? These one. What size are those? Yeah, we found some. What size? Is it? Let me see if these are gonna fit me. I'm gonna try them on and see what I got. Can I try it? Can I try them? Guys, let me try this on real quick. Yeah, it's mad hot. And obviously, like when I got here, I was wearing a hoodie. You guys know this hoodie when I'm traveling, that's what I wear. Anyway, so those slides that she's she's got, they felt a bit tight um, from the sides. So I wanna look around here, the smart and see if I can find a pair. If I can't find a pair, I might go grab those ones, the ones she's got. They're all right, but they're just a bit tight from the side. So let's see. Yeah, they got shoes up here, but they look like kids' shoes. Hmm. Let's see what these ones look. They look, they look a bit old still. Ah, excuse me. Yeah, Hello. bro. Yeah, I'm here. Man. This is yours? Yeah. What what size are those? The Nike ones. What size? Yeah, five six. Do you have eight? Size eight? Let me see if you've got a size that fits me then. If I like them, I'll grab them. We've got a few pairs here. We've got a few here. No, no. In, the, in those ones, the Nike ones, you yeah, don't have one. size eight? These ones, these ones. Oh, this type? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, find me size eight in any and I'll try on it. Yeah? Eight, huh? Yeah. All right, guys, let me see if I can find a pair now. I'll let you know if I buy one. So we found these Christian Dior's. These yeah, ones, eh? They look cute. Yeah, they look, uh, they look good. Yeah, they look good. This is the lady that's selling them to me. <laughs> <laughs> She's saying they look good, so I'm gonna see. Um, I might take these because they feel comfortable when I'm walking. Yeah. They look 
and that's the, the left as well. So that's how the local man rocks them. Christian Dio. I don't know where this guy has gone. So, let me wait and see what price they're gonna quote me. Hopefully, it'll be something good, and then I'll purchase them. And keep it moving, because I need to go get some lunch. But yeah, this lady here sells like a lot of nice shoes. You have a lot of nice shoes. Yeah. You got some Adidas over here. Is she the one that sells it? Yeah, yeah. hi. All right, hello. Hello. How much are the slides? 2K. 2K? Yeah. Just like that, 2K. Okay, not, not but you can talk. <laughs> can talk. Okay, talk to me, how much? Tell me. Maybe I can give you the um, 1,800. Really? <laughs> 1,800. You can check no. the actual number. No, no 1,000? Uh, maybe if you add 200. 1,000. 1,000. Give me 1,000. I'm, I'm a visitor, so be nice to me. I'm a visitor to your country, so... 1,000? <laughs> Not really. Add, add, add 200 on top. Okay, 1,200, yeah? Yeah, 1,200. Okay, you wanna say hello to the people? What's your name? My name is Vanessa. Vanessa? Yeah. Okay, tell them about your business. Actually, I'm from Kenya. Okay. I'm selling my business, shoe business. Yep. And we call it Kicks Wall. Kicks wall. Yeah, at Westland Market. Uh huh. When and you come the number there, of the shop. The number of the shop C fifty six Westland Market. Where where? Yeah. Anything else? Just welcome. Anything else? They should come and buy. From Just me. welcome. <laughs> and you as well, you wanna tell them? Go tell them. Yeah, you should come and buy for me too. Oh, I thought this is, you don't work with Vanessa? No, this is my shop. Oh, yeah, no. but you're a good part, you're a good friend because you're the one that brought me here. I thought, I thought you guys work together. I'm sure yeah, we are. Ah, that's really good. Maybe she can buy you a drink later. True. Yeah, <laughs> yeah guys, so. You should do that. Yeah, she buy, Vanessa should buy her a drink because she's the one that got me here and she called Vanessa to come and go Okay, yeah, I'm just going to tell you. You buy her a drink? Yeah, I buy her. You're on camera. She's a good so. friend. Yeah, she is. So guys, I'm gonna get these slides, yeah. push in the yours, and then I'm gonna keep moving. So guys, um, I just got the slides, and next door to Vanessa's shop, her bestie here sells things as well. So what kind of stuff do you sell? I sell beddings, um, okay. uh, doormats, and stuff, carpets, bedside carpets. Okay, show them, show oh, them. Yeah, this is a bedside carpet. It's look so good and comfortable. Look, it's very so nice, fluffy. Very nice, very nice. And the duvet. Okay. A duvet. This one is a velvet duvet. It's so warm okay. and stuff. We have towels over here. Nice. Uh, first towels. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, we have pillow pillows. Okay, cushions yeah, as well. Yeah, cushions. Like everything is here. Yeah, so guys, you if covered. you want me, beep me. Yeah. So what's your um? So you're in Western Market as well. Yeah, I'm in Western Market. Number? C57. Don't forget C57 Westlands Market. Thank All you. All right. Okay, guys. If you need beddings and you're in Western Nairobi. Come check her out, man. She got some dope stuff. Yeah. Obviously, like I don't live in Kenya, but if I did and I need stuff for my home, I'll definitely check her out. Yeah. yeah. Sure. They look nice. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys. So I'll catch you in a bit. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. So we got the package. There we go. We got the package. We're exiting. Now let's go get some lunch. Of course, one of my favorite restaurants here. Westing Restaurant, or is it? Uh, westlands african restaurant yeah yeah and that's what i'm gonna get right there on the on the thing right there ugali and fish yeah this thing right here i've been looking forward to actually having this coming back here you guys remember i had it last time exactly what i'm gonna have this right here wait wait hello my friend yes how are you how are you happy new year you too bro welcome you remember me okay all right guys so I'll show you what I'm gonna get in a minute. Let me order some food. Right, guys, food is here. Like I showed you over there, on that billboard, on that board right there. There, so, white fish with, uh, well, it's tilapia basically, with a little bit of soup and some cabbage. And of course, we've got the ugali here and a bottle of water to wash it down. So, let me get busy. My first lunch here, my first meal here in Nairobi, this time around. I'm gonna eat and then I'm gonna keep it moving. After here, I'm gonna go uh, to the supermarket to do a bit of shopping, like I said earlier. And we're gonna get back to the apartment, so yeah. Okay guys, so we're done with the food. Belly full. We got that ugali in 
and uh, the fish tilapia now last bit before we head back to the actual apartment I actually haven't even checked in into my apartment yet because when I got there like nearly an hour ago when I arrived at the apartment there was two cleaning it there was two get, getting it ready for me so I left all my bags at the reception so I haven't checked in yet so I'm gonna do some shopping here you guys know this place already thank you <laughs> These guys always remind me to use the walkway. What's up, bro? Yeah. You all right? Cool, cool. So, um, yeah, I just dropped my bags off at the apartment and I came out to obviously sort out my phones, my SIM cards, and then obviously get some food, buy some slides, and then go to Quick Mart, do some shopping, get a few things, get some water, in case, because I haven't been inside the actual apartment yet, so I don't know what they're going to give me, because obviously some hotels and some apartments when you're staying with them they give you some water and stuff so i'm not taking any chances so i'm gonna get some water from here buy a few things and then i'm gonna make my way so probably end this video here i'll continue i'll catch you in the next one so guys if you find any value in these videos make sure you subscribe okay catch you on the next one